What's up? Welcome back. This is Ford Thurston. Uh, thank you for stopping by my YouTube channel. Um, if you haven't subscribed and you dig what I'm doing, just hit the link below. I'd love to have you here. So I love doing this. I love teaching and it's a glorious fall day in Nashville, Tennessee. So in the past uh, week I've been doing, um, I did lesson one, two, and three, which was just basically the layout of the major scale in the key of A. Um, and that walked you all the way up the neck and the idea was just to drone an A note and just mindlessly. Just improvise around it, single notes. That way you can learn the scales everywhere. And then the next one was showing you that the same scale layout works over an E7 chord which makes it then E mixolydian, right? Well, here are the chords that go in that key though. For that scale that I showed you for the A major going all over the neck. Here's the A major seven scale. That's one, seven, six, six. The second chord is a B minor. It's just laying it down. sharp minor, right? D major seven, one, seven, six, seven, E seven, the five chord in the key of A with that scale. That's seven, nine, seven, nine. Okay, then F sharp minor, right? For, this is a drop two voicing. So that's four, six, five, five. second inversion of the first chord is up here, octave up. A major seven chord. Now, I'll explain to you a very simple starting way of how to play to each chord tone. And what we're gonna do is just get to the third of each chord tone, right? So let's just say the bass player hits an A. Well, I could start. Where am I gonna go? hear that right going to the major third of the a starting from the fifth which is in the scale that i laid out and showed you right and then go lead you to the two chord right so that you can start changing chords. So when you're using the scale that I showed you with the drum, you can switch the tone. So we go. step away work. It's a huge note. Lots of people do that. You're going to be able to jump instantly to the notes you're looking for. It's just all the practicing is going, all right, 
I'm gonna play these keys and only target the thirds in my mind. You do that for two weeks, you're gonna know where the thirds are. The next goal is that what you're doing is you have to transpose these skills so that you can take the whole thing and learn and then do everything in G. teaching you guys this stuff is so much fun man i can't tell you how much i enjoy it you know because honestly it's good for me too i mean this stuff might be simple to me at times but the truth is man sometimes i have like light bulb i'm like wow i never thought of that it's like it kind of is like repracticing the roots again but you know um if you can donate anything i have a venmo and a paypal below the links in the description um anything helps me i love doing this i want to concentrate all my time to education and just growing my youtube and all the social media platforms so Thank you so much for stopping by. Practice this stuff. Um, and I'm going to get back to the, you know, more licks. I'm going to start teaching songs and stuff like that. But thank you so much and have a great day. Peace.